back to my channel and you know my name is Wawa Sherry and if you don't know that's because you are not subscribed to my channel be sure hit that subscribe button so you will know next time who I am okay so today video I am finally finally going to do the um, edge control review of two products that I have and um, the first one is going to be the eco factor now this one I have mentioned before in one of my um the War Natural Hair event video and I was waving about it but I never had the chance to actually put it to the test so you guys can see what I'm talking about. So today we are going to do that. And to be fair, this um what is it, Adike? I got this one at the natural hair um event and um I wasn't too fond about it, so I'm just going to go ahead and compare because they're about the same price. So I'm going to compare um, both of them so you guys can see and let me know what you think which one would be better. I personally, you know, I don't want to be biased, but I personally like the um, Eco Factor. Is it Eco Factor? No, Edge Booster. Better. So what I'm going to do is um, put the edge booster in one size and put the out of K in another size so I'm gonna put it on um go about my day and then come back to cat to the camera once I notice like something is changing if there is in this one or that one and then I'm gonna come back so you guys can be the judge okay so um let's see as you guys can see I have been using this I murder it I got the pineapple flavor because um, it's all the same thing. If you see different colors, it's all the same thing. It's just how um, the color is um, reflected on what scent it has. So I got the pineapple flavor. And it smells like pineapple. Purely pineapples, okay? And um, this one is supposed to be lemongrass. See, as you guys can see, um, I didn't even use this one. But I think I used it. I really didn't give it a chance, to be honest with you. Because I saw... I'm so in love with the edge booster that I don't want to change. And look, as you can see, this is like almost done and this one barely been touched. So today we're going to see have I been neglecting the outer cave for no reason and maybe this can be my second favorite one. You never know, but let's get started. Okay, so I'm using the edge control brush. Okay, so this one in that side what is this my no, actually I'm gonna put it in this side since I'm left-handed one um the cake we are going to put it on the right side this thing is so thick it's look even me trying to get it out it's hard to get out it's so thick oh you guys by the way one thing when I was watching with you about the um uh, edge booster that they were saying that it flicks now it does flick in dirty hair because if you um, put it in like every day for a, for a week it will flick but if you just wash your hair and you put it in um, it will not flick so it's a it's the type of product that you have to add to clean hair truly truly giving um, the RK edge control a chance so all these faces I'm making this is what I do with all new products that I don't know what to expect from them Th that's, that's what I do you guys 
it just happened to be on camera this time, okay? But this is exactly what I do. But what I've noticed is it apply really, really thick. Like I'm pressing really hard because I don't want it seems like I literally just glue this thing to my head. I want like a natural, you know, a natural way. Like this one, I get shine from it. Like this one look more natural to me than this side. Do you guys see what I'm talking about? Okay, so that's the finishing result. Um, I'm gonna go off camera, um, let it work to see how long it's gonna stay. And then so we can compare the two really. And the time is now 1.17. So I will see you guys until I notice anything different, okay? Back with the result for you. And remember, this was the um, outer K size and this was the um, was the edge booster so it is now 334 so about three hours since I had this in and you let me know which one was better okay and this was the out of case sign for three hours I did not okay I did not um tie my hair down after I put the gel I mean the edge control in so um, in my defense I feel like the edge booster one which I would have thought this one just turned into a grease to be honest like it's like hold on let me make sure I'm touching the right side yeah it's, do, do you, can you guys see the grease Like it's literally turning to grease, which I expected because from previous edge control I have tried before because I have tried a lot of edge control, you guys. And as when I was putting it in, it would it apply the same way as the previous edge control would apply. So I kind of knew this was going to happen. So yeah, I don't know. Maybe um you like your edges greasy. Um, I don't know. So which one do you like better? Which one work better? Um, that's all for this video. I hope this was helpful in making your decision. And if you like these type of comparison videos, please let me know because I do have more edge control that I would like to have more than over 10 brand. I was in a mission to find the perfect edge control. So um, let me know. That's all for this video. Before to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye. Deuces.